All you do is grab your spoolie, grab your lashes, and you just brush the heck out of them. Walgreens! Ohio gozaimasu. I'm on my way to Canada today. I'm gonna film an interview for my other channel video influencers. I thought I'd pick up um, one of Judy's bags as a gift for the person that I'm interviewing. And plus, I like seeing Judy's back here, so. Ooh, ah. honey, you are so awesome. You think Trina would like this one? I don't know. Or, or this one. Maybe both. Good afternoon. It would have been morning if it wasn't daylight savings, but we're on our way back home from Vancouver. You guys excited to go home? Yeah. yeah. No? Yeah, yeah, maybe so. I just checked and it says there's only 10 minute wait at the border, so we'll see. It's 15 minutes. Thank goodness for a DVD player. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. I am impressed. Thank you so much. Got her the bags, honey. I am so excited. <laughs> Because you guys don't have Walgreens here, right? Yeah. No. Andy is just uh, showing us his beautiful place, beautiful view here. In this video, I interviewed Trina Dura about what it takes to be successful in the beauty community today and the reality of dealing with hate and negativity coming up. We're back in town. We're visiting Mama and Papa. She got sick again 20 minutes before we got home. Did you take a mini nap too? Yay. Some dope green juice. Yeah, and beet juice. And beet juice. On Facebook yesterday, I stumbled upon this video that blew my mind. Blew my mind. And I have to share. So, you know, I'm kind of a lash fanatic. Kinda, sorta. Even though I own a thousand pairs of lashes, I still buy more because I'm addicted. But my go-to are wispies. You know when you go to the drugstore or like even the dollar store, you find these really cheap looking lashes that are, you know, kind of like this. The ones I'm wearing right now were actually like really straight. I'm going to show you how to make them look wispy and full, like kind of look like mink lashes. All you do is grab your spoolie, grab your lashes, and you just brush the heck out of them. So this wasn't the best set to demonstrate, but you see how it gives it the wispy effect? So the lashes I'm wearing right now were just like the straight, long, super thick triangle lashes, and I brushed it over and now it's full and wispy and it curled it even more. Um, but I love it. I just want to share that. I need to go and grab some cupcakes for the girls' school because Mia, or actually Kira, is going to be celebrating her birthday at school tomorrow. At first I was thinking, why don't they just celebrate it both at the same time? They are individual people, so I thought it was sweet how the teacher scheduled it so that they would have their own, like, celebrate their own birthday at school. I feel like birthdays are never just one day, especially in our family because we have such a big family. Just the fact that I had a birthday cake yesterday, and my birthday was back in February because <laughs> I never got to spend time with my cousins for my birthday. We never got to celebrate. Next weekend, a week from today, it's Mia and Kira's birthday party. Rather than a birthday, it's almost like a birthday month. It is actually hot. It's 66 degrees. What is happening? When does spring officially start? How perfect are these cupcakes? And they're tiny too. Wow, so my dad assembled this. You guys don't step on it like that. I don't get what's this supposed to do. Oh, a jukebox? No, pretend music. Yeah, a jukebox? No! Pretend music? So there's a restaurant. We have some impatient customers. And this is the cook, but she ran out of food. I don't think I want to be a part of this restaurant if there's always going to be fights at the restaurant. Nobody wants to go if there's always fights. Okay, so how do you cook? Uh, in the food. Well, where's your stuff? Oh, the food's here. I set up it. Pretend! You want to pretend oh. that you want to pretend you didn't have to go. Okay. Hi, excuse me, ma'am. Can I get some scrambled eggs? Mm. Mm, scrambled eggs. No, no, no. Scrambled eggs. It's, okay. it's a fuck card. It's okay. I want scrambled eggs. 
not here. You, oh, you ran out? Well, what else do you Mommy, have available? Mommy, but that is it's dead. Whoa. Oh, a crab? A dead crab? It's dead crab. It's actually dead. Okay. Don't see it. Okay. <laughs> There's lots of food in there. You have to cook it. Why is everyone screaming? And there's a toy shop next door. So, okay, restaurants closed. They couldn't pay their workers. Now it's open, come on. But I think I want to buy toys at the toy shop. Okay, how much is that one? $30. Okay, there you go. How much is that one? Thirty dollars? Oh, that's a lot of money. Thirteen? Oh, seven dollars. Okay, there you go. Mommy, did a Barbie toy shop. Dead crab. Dead. Oh, okay. It's not alive, so I could eat it. Oops. Thanks, Dad. Well, she better. I'm sick of your fighting. If you're gonna fight, you're gonna have to just stay in your room all night. Pizza party with my girls. Where's my butt butt go? Your butt butt is connected to your butt. No, my butt butt girls. <laughs> Do you remember your butt butt girls? Oh, you? butt butt girls? Is that is that your band name? I don't like it. After dinner, we're gonna butt have butt a butt lip butt. syncing party. What? Are you ready? Let it to me. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I forgot to tell you guys about this insane dream I had last night and it felt so real. I think it was so vivid in my mind because JB woke me up as I was dreaming it. But I had a dream that I was pregnant by one of the Backstreet Boys and it was actually through insemination. And I remember when I was taking the test, I accidentally dropped it into the toilet and then it tested a positive pregnancy and then I was like wait wait a second what if somebody else went pee and somebody else was pregnant and it took their pee and not mine so then I took a second one and then it did confirm I was pregnant but it was just like the most random strange dream anyways on that note I'm gonna end the vlog and I will see you guys next time